Hello, Adam Rayner reporting for Talk Audio TV. Yes, not the Angler's Mail, despite the bulrushes and the pretty watery flowers, because in actual fact, this is leafy Surrey. And, uh, well, I'm at Sony in Weybridge at their headquarters. There's the beautiful building and the uh, magic word Sony up on the building. And in fact, I'm sat inside a golf belonging to Sony with Rob Berg and Mr. Dave McCulloch. Hi guys, how are you? Hi. And uh, I know you're seeing a little bit nervous. This is take three. <laughs> We're doing looking at Miralink on the uh, XAV601BT. Um, and you guys, the reason you're both in it is because there's two tribes. One who has an N8 and the other one a Galaxy S2. Da -da -da -da. Right, let's uh, plug in the N8 first into this here head unit. What you're seeing is Miralink. This is a system um, well, it's been uh, promulgated by many different manufacturers. It's an answer to the whole uh, Apple total emulation of iPods type thing. And it's about Android phones. And, and these definitely, Nokia and Samsung, <laughs> These are, this ain't Clopper Castle, friendly enemies. This is proper business competitors, but it's in their interest to have the likes of Sony and other car audio manufacturers do that. That is so cool. Miralink, show us um, show us the head unit, make the telephone do something there, Mr. Uh, McCulloch. We'll pop a web browser. Web browser, yes, that's something that's... Oh, 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 oh BBC News. Let's have a little zoom in on that just to look at that. Oh, that is so cool. <laughs> that's on your head unit. Of course, we are parked at the moment. If you're going to be doing this while you're driving along, you will be making sure it's a passenger and that the wire is uh, correctly connected. The uh, law requires you to pay attention all the time. Now, one of the reasons this is another take is that what we did do was um, found that when we connected it to a different phone, we had actually got to reboot the head unit first. So, yep, we've seen the Nokia do it. So let's disconnect the Nokia. And... Uh, Quick navigation demonstration. Oh, there. navigation, sorry. God, God, gosh, gosh, there's me blithering away here. <laughs> there's more to see. Let's uh, let's get zoomed back in over there, sorry. So getting so excited that it was all working beautifully. When I say working beautifully, I'm talking about my tech. So uh, setting up navigation from the phone and bam, a system that hasn't got the navigation plugged into it is suddenly showing sat-nav. That is, uh, <laughs> that's what you call high cup size technology, guys. I like that, that is cool. Okay, so uh, that's uh, Mr. McCulloch's moment. Now it's Rob's go. We've just uh, taken the head off the unit and taken the USB wire. <laughs> These guys are acting so cool. They are proper nervous. <laughs> <laughs> Holding up Sony's pride in their technology. That's the whole point is uh, Miralink really is cool tech. I've seen this on a, an Alpine unit on a stand at the Gadget Show, but this is the first time we've seen Miralink in a car. And, uh, well, it is sexy cool technology. And here we go, right live on Talk Audio TV. A little bit of a pause. Here's where we waited last time. Since Samsung car mode, da, 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 how happy are you? What we were worrying about there. Well, what we were worrying about. Perfect, there we go. Samsung and Nokia, both phones. Let's uh, have their head unit control the uh, the Samsung. Let's have it do some stuff. It's not just one pretty picture. Saying good afternoon. Oh, there's stuff showing up. That was oh, that where you have to put in a password, which we will see yeah. on the internet if you type it. <laughs> 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 That's the only thing we didn't work yeah. out. I did that on uh, on Talk Audio as well. I actually had to uh, do the video again because I'd uh, I'd put my own telephone number on the internet <laughs> yes, there. So, mine's uh, there as well, isn't it? Brilliant. But uh, Mr. Rob Berg and Dave yeah, McCulloch, yeah. who are Sony's car radio specialists, thank you very very much indeed for sitting in the car park by the pond here with a strange fat man um, and uh, showing us Sony Miralink. Of course, the uh, Sony phones will be um, fully mirror linked by the next generation. How long before they have to wait? It's now sort of August 2012. When, when are we looking at, uh, Rob? We're looking at first quarter of 2013, realistically, um, before most of our phones will be compatible with it. Marvellous. And in the meanwhile, of course, the head units are there ready waiting. Indeed, yes. Fabulous. Adam Rayner, Rob Berg and Dave McCulloch signing out.